A Drokul Vagant. Already fused him. Oh, another one. Kendra Pond. Nice, nice. Alright, what is up guys? 200 ancient shards. Here we go. Double chance. Weekend. Let's see what we get. See how many legendaries we got. We got 100 now and we'll open up a little bit more later with our gems. Once we make space. Salota. Rockbreaker. Vergus. Three epics already in the opening. Not bad, not bad. Thenesil. Very nice. Very good support. Alrighty. Let's keep it going. Oathbound. Relic Keeper. Not bad, not bad. Excruciator. Not so lucky that time with the epics. Excruciator, eh. Niche arena. Ultimate Gaelic, not bad. First legendary, Elenaril. She's alright. She's got that HP burn on the A1. The poison on the A2. Then her most notable skill is the combust right there. Uses all poison debuffs, usually one tick instantly. Could be better. But no complaints, I'll take it. Crip Witch, Flesh Terror. Not bad, that'll help. And our second legendary, Bacillus. Mm. Got the steel buff A1, the triple hit, ignore shield, and block damage, and then the stun or reduce speed. Magic keep, legendary. Some arena value as well. Just a bunch of rares. Dog cut. Talia, not bad. Hexia. Oh, gotta get more slots. Awkward. Just looking at their recommended ratings. Not very high. Very niche. Good. Hexia, same. Heals. Increase speed. Increase attack. on the bottom let's get some new slots gonna spend some silver since we have a little bit and we'll keep going Karam uh, not very good poison crit poison maybe for faction worse Gotta get more slots. Bunch of rares, nothing good there.
Let's just expand our vault. Save a little bit of money. Make sure, guys, next time, obviously, if you do an opening or anything like that, make sure you have room <laughs> so you don't have to go through all this awkward stuff. And we'll keep it going. Nothing, just Luria as Alota again, another dude. Possible freeze, possible remove all buffs. Block buffs. Gore mask. Magus. Sentinel. Spirit host. Bog walker. See if we can get anything good, come on. River and Bane. We'll go ahead and open the void. Let's see what we get. Dilgal. The Fire Knight guy. And Faction Wars. And a legendary. Black Knight. Not bad, okay, he's got the Provoke on the A1. He's got the Heal on the A2, which is pretty good if you can get that booked as well to have a two turn cooldown. And then the last one, he attacks all enemies depending on how much HP is lost. And then unkillable, again, if it damage exceeds 15%. Not bad. Could be better. So I used some of my gems, we're gonna open up some more shards, here we go. Bought a bunch of packs, got a lot of gems, let's turn those gems into hopefully some legendaries as well. If it loads. Oathbound. Alright, alright. Crip Witch, Warden. Alright, not bad. Some more dupes. Shatterbones, Hexia, Jotun. Not bad. Very cool, very cool. Dark Aethel. Not bad. She's good all around. Go ahead and get more of them from our mailbox and keep it rolling. Uh oh, big drop, big money, big money. <laughs> A Drokul the Gaunt. Already fused him. Oh, another one. Kendrafon. Nice, nice. Okay. Drokul, I could do without. We already fused one. And Kendrafon, that is a very nice PvP legendary. Very happy about that. That's good. Bunch of rares. Basilisk, Catacomb Counselor, not bad. Adriel. Infernal Baroness, Grimskin, Jingle Hunter, Dark Aethel. Ripper. Then 
Zana, Sikara. Nazana good, Sakara, nah. She's okay. Drake. If only it was a real Dracomorph. Dracomorph Jr. Decreased accuracy. Attacks, always crit. Increases the arena. And attacks if killed, extra turn. Rip. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you liked the video. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. If you like more videos with shard openings like this, be sure to let me know down below. And thank you so much, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.